Hi everyone, welcome to Vishwa Blooms. In this video, we will be looking at class 8 packages AIM 1 Certs Maths Techno Vishwa Blooms. So, let's begin with packages Pearl Package. Now, Pearl Package, first question is if the certs, so these are the certs, okay, root A, root B, and root C are certs such that they gain condition root a plus root b gives rise to root is equal to root c then root a and root b are obviously when you are adding up two certs and giving you some some other cert these two certs need to be similar in order to be added up and to give a new uh, sum right so they are similar option b second one second question is Statement A. So, statement type question. Statement A. Third of 7th order is root 7. When 7th order, when you are telling that, actually, it should be in this way. But, in the statement, he told it like this. So, this is wrong, right? So, this statement A is wrong. Next, we will look at the second statement. That second statement says that third of third order is in this way yes that is correct only so here the third is of the third order right so what is the option it is d that is a is uh, wrong and b is correct clear next we will look at the third question here that is also one of the statement types of question only so statement a Product of two similar quadratic cert is a, an irrational number. So, in the introduction video already I explained that. When two similar quadratic certs are being multiplied, they'll, it is a rational number. So, statement A is false. Next, looking at statement B. So, what does it state? The product of two dissimilar quadratic certs is a cert. That is correct. Now, if you want examples, I'll give examples for both. Now, for statement A, when two similar certs, that means 3 root 2 into 5 root 2, when I'm doing, I'm going to get a rational number because 3 into 5 into root 2 into root 2. 3 into 5 is 15 and root 2 into root 2 is 2. So, 15 2 is 30. Now, 30, it is not a rational number. It is a rational number, right? So, that is why I could conclude that statement A is false. Now, we will look at the statement B and I, I, like we already looked at it, but I am going to give the example. Now, what are dissimilar certs generally? You know, right? Dissimilar certs are 2 root 3 into 2 root 5. Suppose when you are taking this, 2 to 2 into 2 is 4. Then 4 root, you can't multiply them first main thing, right? Because their orders are same, but even, yeah, you can. 4 root 15. Now, this is a, is this a rational number? No. But in the statement, they told that it is a cert. But this is obviously a cert. So, it is a cert. That is why this statement is correct. Okay, now fourth one, it is also statement type of question. So, statement A tells that coefficient of two similar certs is a rational number. Now, coefficient of two similar certs. Now, I am going to take two similar certs. That is 2 root 3 divided by 4 root 3. Now, root 3, root 3 get cancelled. 2 ones, 2 twos. Now, 1 by 2. Now, 1 by 2 is it a rational number? Yes, it is a rational number and the statement is Correct statement only. Now, statement B, it says that coefficient of two dissimilar certs is a cert. Now, dissimilar certs, what are dissimilar certs? These are dissimilar certs. Now, I am going to divide them. 2, 2 will get cancelled. Now, root 3 by so, root 5, obviously, it is a Third, so this statement is also correct and option A and for third one option D. Okay, now we will look at the next question. Now, next questions are passage type of questions. Now, they have given passage where are, there are three points. Okay, now first point is third of order 2 is quadratic third. 
second point is third of order 3 is cubic third third of order 4 is bi quadratic third now this three statements we already know this statements okay now we will look at the questions fifth question first among the following quadratic third is now i will show the question once so here quadratic third where it is which is having two as the power right now which one you will choose the answer now you will get you will think first a option a see here three is there so easily you will be able to understand this is not the right answer so you will just put a cross mark this is not the answer that is fixed but here you see two 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 now you will get confused now i will explain and tell you what, what is the correct answer now see first root four now root four how you can write that root over two square root over two square now this square root will get cancelled now what is the answer it is two is it a quadratic third no there is no order only first my thing right in this question so this b option is wrong now looking at c option now eight can be written as two cube now two cube and root is there so it is correct only this is the answer correct c is correct next why not this now square root or when it is right here two is there or square root both are same only here four means square root four can be represented as two square this square and root will get cancelled and it is two that is why this option is also wrong now what is the correct answer c that is clear to you right why why i have confused i mean you got confused there sixth one among the following cubic third is here it is uh, again a different part now you will by seeing this question itself you will definitely remove this option b and option d from your mind because here the order is not this not 3 when it is cubic order should be 3 here it is not there so obviously b and d immediately will scratch it off but coming to a and c you will be confused when which op option you have to opt for now i'll tell you that so first which options you will scratch b and d next a and c i will tell you which is the right option now this can't be simplified anymore this is a cubic third now we have to check whether this is a cubic third or not now 27 can be written as 3 cube now this cube and cube root will get cancelled so this is 3 whereas it is no longer a third so this is wrong option and only correct answer is a understood now seventh question is among the following a bi quadratic third now bi quadratic means the order with four order four should be there right now by seeing option a and d you would not think of that but option b and c will be confused now first this can be a third for bi quadratic now whereas c i'll tell you now fourth root 16 can be written as 2 power 4 okay now here for uh, the fourth and the fourth root both will get cancelled right now what is left out only two whereas it is no longer a third so what is the right option b c right option and c is the wrong option now matrix matching in the column one you could see questions and in column two you have to match it now fourth root of 3 what is it it is a monomial third okay 2 root 3 and 4 root 3 are what are they they are like thirds and they are also monomial thirds right and they are also mixed thirds three options are there for ninth one b c and even d and whereas for eighth one there is only one option b okay 10th one 3 by 2 root 8 what is it it is first of all a monomial third and also a mixed third right next one is 7 root 5 and 7 root 6 are they are dissimilar thirds and they are monomial thirds they are also mixed thirds so you wouldn't be understand anything here i'll write the options here eighth one is b ninth one is b c and d tenth one is b and d and eleventh one is a b d 
Now this would be clear for you. And matrix matching is done. Let's move on to EP. Emerald package. First question. If root if th three root a plus one and four root five are similar certs, they are similar certs. Then what is the value of a? Is the question. Now it is very simple. When they are similar certs, their you know this value should be the same. Their rooted value must must be the same. So a plus one must be equal to five. Okay. Now a is equal to five minus one. A is equal to four. This is option D. That is clear, right? So simple one, but question looks so complicated, right? Yeah. Next second one. If cubed root of a plus one into fourth root of five. Is a mixed cert. Then the least possible value of a is. So what is mixed cert actually? There should be one rational factor as well as there should be one irrational factor, right? So here this is an irrational factor. You can't do anything to it. But here you have an option of making this rational, right? When you can make a as seven. I'm going through the options. When you can make a seven cube root of seven plus one into fourth root of five can actually give you a mixed third because seven plus one is eight cube root of eight into fourth root of five cube root of eight is two because two cube is eight. Now two into fourth root of five is a mixed third, right? So a Is equal to seven is the least possible value of a. So option E is also a only. Okay. Next is third question in Emerald package. Among the following, a third is now pi is a irrational number, but it is not a third. So you can't take this. This is also an irrational number, but not a third. This is a rational number, and this is an Sorry, this is a this is a rational number, whereas this is the right answer because this is an irrational number. D that is root over sixteen point nine is the correct option. That means it is a third. Now this brings us to the end of A one, right? So we have completed. So. do like share and subscribe to vishwa blooms and mainly don't forget to click that bell icon so thanks for watching bye and please support vishwa blooms